Good morning, Torque family. Here's another workout coming at you Tuesday, this Tuesday coming up, but I don't know what date that is. What we're up to um, for our warm up is we have 20 tall marches, we have 10 arm swings forward and backward, we have five push ups, 10 squats, 10 torso rotations to the left and to the right, finished up with 10 dynamic spiders, six to each side. Then we're going to move into some controlled articular rotations. We're going to start at the top and we're going to work through the neck. Then we're going to hit the shoulder. Then we're going to hit the spine. Then we're going to do our hips and then we'll finish up around the ankles. So our warm up, we do our arm, excuse me, we're going to start out with our tall marching. So we're here, knees high, hands high. After that, we move on to our arm circles, which are going to be forward and reverse. Then we're going to hit our push up. For five repetitions, we're going to uh, go into 10 air squats, okay? After we finish our air squats, we're going to do a torso rotation for a total of 20, 10 to each side there. And then we're going to wrap that up with our dynamic spiders, where we're going to press down. If you want to rotate, you can. I'm going to rock it back, sit on that heel, and stretch that hamstring out. From there, we move on to the controlled articular rotations where I'm gonna start out with looking to my right and holding for three to five seconds, to the left three to five seconds, and then trying to put my forehead on the floor rather than sticking my chin to my chest. I wanna look down and force down for three to five seconds. From there, we're gonna move into shoulders where we're gonna pull into this overhead position and pull hard, and then we're gonna slowly bring the arm down to the outside all the while trying to pull it behind us. We're gonna do that to each side. From there, we move into the spine, then we're gonna cross over, opposite hands to shoulders, and we're gonna crunch forward, and we're gonna hold, and then we're gonna rotate and hold, and then we'll rotate to the other side and hold. When we finish with the T-spine, we'll move to our hip, where we're going to go knee up, we're gonna abduct that hip, and then we're gonna force that knee down while we compress our hamstring and our glutes. Um, when we finish with our hamstrings, we're simply just going to go up on our toes and hold, and then we're going to come on our heels and pull our toes up and hold, and then that will be our piece there wrapping up those controlled articular rotations. Um, a skill strength piece, we have two rounds of four minutes where you're going to do shoulders. You're going to do front raises, you're going to do lateral raises, and you're going to do posterior raises. You're going to do eight repetitions in each one of these positions maintaining for four minutes, then you get a two minute rest, and then you're gonna repeat another four minute bout of those eight repetitions in each position of the shoulder work. All right, I'm gonna go over the shoulder work. Okay, remember I said we have two minute, two four minute bouts with a two minute rest in between. The shoulder work is front raises here, lateral raises, little bend in the arm, and then a bent over fly or a posterior raise little bend in the arm, thinking about squeezing my shoulders, my posterior delts, and my upper back together. And just, I wanted to go over those movements really quick for you so you know what you're doing. Um, Weight-wise, I started out with 20s and then finished up with 10s by the time I was at the end of my second four minute bout of shoulders. It gets a little burny, try and push through that lactic acid. That'll raise the bar a little bit, okay? So stay under control. Pick a good weight for you. I think for ladies, um, you know, 10 pounds is probably a good place to start, and then you can work it from there. Uh, like I said, I started out with 20s, and they started to get real heavy real fast. Um, take breaks in between when you need them, but try and stay busy for the four minutes um, that you have to work. And like I said, you have two four-minute sections of shoulders, okay? It's going to be a good one. From there, we move into the workout of the day, which is going to be a total of 120 repetitions. We're going to do six rounds of 10 hang muscle clean to a push press and 10 jumping squat lunges. And I'm going to show you what that looks like. So the hang to the push press, I got my dumbbells. I'm going to bow forward. I'm going to muscle clean it. So no dip when I receive it. After I receive it, then I'll dip drive and press overhead, muscle clean, dip, drive and press overhead, here, dip, drive and press overhead. 
10 repetitions there. Directly into the jumping lunge squat. So lunge, lunge, squat, lunge, lunge, squat, lunge, lunge, squat. So we have six rounds of that, 10 repetitions in each one of those spaces. Good luck with it, I did it. It took me almost 14 minutes. It's very challenging, you can hear them winded already. So look forward to seeing you on Tuesday. Hope you're having a great weekend. Cheers.